probably shouldn't remember. <laughs> uh, but, I mean, I guess the biggest party, like, where we went to where all the bands were there. I remember being in uh, the UK, it was like on the Bring Me the Horizon tour, we played, um, what was that, Birmingham. And the, the show turned into a club afterwards, and everyone from every band was in the club. And, like, it was awesome. There was, like, a bounce pit. You could go jump in the foam pit and all this stuff. And it was, it was probably one of the craziest parties I've ever been to. So, yeah. That's cool. Yeah, it was <laughs> awesome. Yeah, the sleeping. There's this band from, from uh, Long Island in the United States and, uh, called The Sleeping, and they... They literally the hardest partiers I've ever seen in my life. It's insane. They, they never stop. It's like 6 in the morning and they're still going. It's like they don't give a shit. Um, well, we just did a tour with Under Oath and uh, Close Your Eyes uh, not that long ago in the States. And uh, we show up and we're playing at a horse ranch. And there's a stage built between these two stables. It's like on a horse racetrack, and then we're like, where's the venue? Where are we playing? They're like, you guys are playing right there. And we're like, there's like horse shit everywhere, and there's like, <laughs> it was literally just like a horse stable, two stables, and then our stage. It's crazy. <laughs> prank? Yeah. Um, he'll prank some lights. <laughs> I'd probably yeah. prank. Yeah, we got a couple going on right now. I can't really tell you about them because they're like in the middle of it, and like I don't want the person to like find out. But big secret. Yeah, we we're currently pranking our guitar player Kevin. So we can't really talk about it too much though. You prank me by throwing mud in my eye once. Yeah, I, did. Yeah. I was trying to hit Alex, and then Josh turned around and then I got mud in his eye, and then we had to go to the hospital. Yeah. Uh, what's some other ones out there? I broke the windshield in our van. Um, yeah. uh, <laughs> tons of stories. Yeah, so it's bad. Uh, I'm not really embarrassed yeah, of anyone I listen uh, to. I listen to like silly stuff. I've been listening to a lot of NSYNC. Uh huh. And uh, Katy Perry. Yeah, all that stuff. Last cool. Friday night. That's my shit. Sean Kingston. Uh huh. So good. <laughs> and then, um, you know, just stuff like that. Mm -hmm. We're really kind of like into boy bands <laughs> and pop music. It's true. <laughs> we listened to the new Terminal record yesterday. Uh huh. It's awesome. It's really good. Yeah. Fine. And new Thrice, the new Thrice CD. It's amazing. Yeah, we love it. And we've been listening to a uh, new Coldplay CD too. Do you like it? Yeah, like it's it. pretty cool. Yeah? Yeah. I'm not a really big fan of the band. No? <laughs> we make him listen anyways. So. There's a couple songs that sound pretty cool though. Um, my favorite show was probably, uh, one of them was like, I went and saw Blink-182 and Newfound Glory in Midtown. That was probably my favorite. And then another favorite was when I went and saw uh, The Starting Line. They played with Take Back Sunday. And, uh, it was incredible. Awesome. Mine would probably be one tour, one more tour in 2003, I think. Three or four. Oh, 2003, I think.
Try to get every day to every the gym. Day, yeah. Gym. Yeah? yeah. And you like it or it's kind yeah. of boring sometimes? Yeah, I, we love it. it. It makes the day go by faster. Uh -huh. Like if uh, if maybe you can't find something to do at the venue or at the or something and you get to go to the gym and just not think about anything and just exercise. It's kind of it's relaxing for me at least. That's cool. Yeah. 